Hey guys, for Shree Star here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your Facebook not working by going through all the troubleshooting steps that you need in order to fix it. So let's get started. So whenever Facebook is not working for you, there's a couple things you want to do. First thing is for your iPhone, you want to go ahead and pull on the control menu or pull it up, put your phone on airplane mode briefly, and then turn it back off. And it does a quick network refresh with your connectivity to the internet because sometimes it might be that your internet connection is weak or something's going on. You want to go ahead and do that. And after you do that, the next thing you want to do, go ahead, is if you have it open on your iPhone, swipe up like this, and you're going to want to swipe it up to force quit it and then go ahead again. Now, that might work for you, and that's great if it is. Now, if it's still not working, the next thing to try is either if you have Wi-Fi turned on, pull on the control menu, turn off Wi-Fi momently, and see if it works uh, data now if you have why if you have data on go to a place where you can connect to Wi-Fi and see if that works for you just to test out that it's not your internet connection either through Wi-Fi or your cellular data now after you have done that and you're still having issue with Facebook not working now another thing to check out is to check if Facebook is currently down for your area so once in a while Facebook is down because they're doing work on server or some outage happened now you can check that by going into any browser and search up something called uh, Facebook. So you want to search up things like Facebook and then search up Down Detector. So Down Detector is a website that tracks if certain uh, things are down, like websites and things like uh, many social media sites. So if you search that up, it will indicate pretty much if it's down or uh, something is going on, if you're having issues with it. And you can kind of look at to see as you can see here, Facebook outage report in the last 24 hours. And if there is an outage going on, you're just going to have to wait until uh, for Facebook fix it because they'll fix it uh, usually within a couple hours, sometimes a little bit longer, depending on what the issue is going on. Now, if you find that it's not that it's down, it's working, we can try a different thing like go use Facebook on a browser, on a computer, somewhere else to verify that Facebook account works for you. You can do the next thing, which is updating your Facebook app. In order to do that, you can go into your app store, check, see if there's an update by going into a search here and just search of Facebook, right? Once you search of Facebook, what will happen is you'll see there's a button for update. Now, if it says open, that means it's already updated. So this one, I can update Facebook. So I go ahead and click on update. And the reason why you want to do that is when the phone gets updated, the Facebook software app needs to get updated to match the version to work like sort of like the compatibility so if there's an update I'll go ahead and update it after update it and you can go ahead and open it up and hopefully working the update shouldn't take much uh, long maybe 30 seconds to a minute now once you see that open button that means it's been updated or you can go ahead and open it up same exact thing slide up and close it out if it's open and then reopen it just like that and hopefully it's working now if it's still not working the next thing you want to do is a force restart on your iPhone so in order to force restart you're going to press and release the volume up press and release the volume down and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and once you see the Apple logo appear let go of that button so I'm going to do volume up volume down and then I hold on to that side button just like that and I'm going to wait for the screen to go completely black and the Apple logo to appear and we just keep on holding it as you can see here and you can do this as many times as you need to this is completely safe basically shuts down the phone software and reloads the code again you may have to make sure that you press volume up and volume down quickly one after another and if you don't get the hang of it the first time again try it a few times until this method works so you press and release the volume up press and release the volume down and hold on to that side button until the screen goes completely black and once you're back on go ahead and try to open up Facebook and hopefully it is working now let's say it's still not working the next thing you want to do is in your setting of your iPhone go down to general go all the way down here to transfer reset iPhone we click on first option for reset and we do want to do a network reset so what a network reset does is basically it resets things like your uh, Wi-Fi password or uh, anything uh, that Bluetooth connected devices, those will come up. You go ahead and click on reset. Now this method, again, will not delete any of your personal data. So all of your photos, videos, apps will be fine. This will take about maybe 30 seconds to a minute to do. And once you do that, go back and connect to either Wi-Fi. Uh, if you had a Wi-Fi connection or your cellular data should allow you to go ahead and open up and use Facebook. Now, if you're still having the issue, the next thing to do is delete and reinstall a Facebook app. To delete it, you simply 
press and hold just like that click on remove app and then click on delete app now once it's been deleted you're gonna go to the app store search for Facebook error and find it and any Facebook app you're gonna get it or download it again to it just like that or you might see that icon right there and basically reinstalling it will help if there's any issues going on and after you do that and you're still having issues, the next thing to do is updating your iPhone by going to your settings, going to general, software update, and check if there's an update out. If there is, go ahead and update your phone. Give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes. And once you do that, hopefully Facebook is working. So by going through all these troubleshooting steps, your Facebook app should be working on your iPhone now. If so, please do consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your Facebook app and other apps as well. See you guys next time.